He was once just a thug from around the way. But life was never easy. That's right. Life is never easy. In fact, Yeezy named the song after EZ. Mainly Z. Mainly Z. And we're going to go through our reaction to the game. A clear and sociopath. Kanye West, or maybe just Ye, whatever his name is. Ye. We're going to react to this video because it is hilarious. It's something. <laughs> he did make it. He did make it. The this, this song itself doesn't actually get interesting until... Ever. Ever. Until you get... Oh, my <laughs> until God. Until you get up to butthole eyes. Fuck, that's disturbing. <laughs> There's like... It's like a Wes Anderson movie, but a weird porn. People are very... Very concerned for the life... Of Pete Davidson. Of Pete Davidson. They think there's something to worry about because... he has because the power of the butthole eyes. He does have butthole eyes. He will consume ye. He will... He will consume ye! Easy! So, hey. we're just gonna skim through this. We're not actually gonna play it for you because we'll get pulled. But I... It's I also not a good song. Yeah. <laughs> see how I was... See? He's got... He's got his head in his hands. He decapitated Pete Davidson. That's that's yay. That's Kanye yep. West. That is murder. This whole video is about Kanye West fantasizing about killing Pete Davidson and dealing with his wife. Because he is fucking putting Kim Kardashian in a wheelchair with his large penis. <laughs> I maybe not because she ain't so happy. You know what's fascinating about this that I just thought of? What's that? Do you see this image right here where he's on he's on an ATV with Pete Davidson on the back because he abducted Pete Davidson. Uh -huh. The first time we got to experience the Kanye Kim Kardashian thing was the two of them kind of like having sex on a motorcycle. What? There was a video where she's like riding him while he's riding a motorcycle. What? Yeah, that's the first time. Uh, it's something about my dark nightmare. I forget. I forget the song. It escapes me. But this seemed like a good allegory for that because that was the really, really the first time they publicly exposed their their relationship. They were fucking on an ATV. No, it was on a motorcycle, not an ATV. The yeah. ATV is strictly to carry Pete Davidson. But I feel like there's some sort of analogy to be had there. He's dragging Pete Davidson's body. He's a disturbing man. And then video. he buries Pete Davidson in the ground. But he earlier in the video, he was decapitated. So what, what's going on here? The, he's holding him. That's afterwards. Oh, okay. that's the aftermath. This timeline's all over the place. Yeah, it, it's very complex. So he pulls the mask off and it's Pete Davidson buried in the ground. Ooh, right? Deep butthole eyes. This is deep and so Scared full of but buttholes. Fierce. Scared but fierce. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, and then he decides to pour rose seeds on Pete Davidson's rose head. Bud. And then rose bud in your butt. See, he like plants them on him. What do you think the symbology of that is? Um, six feet under. But what about the rose seeds? I don't know. Was Did he give uh, Kim Kardashian some roses? I don't know. Maybe. No, it's... <laughs> And then he's talking to his head. <laughs> like, this is freaking awesome. Oh, and I wanted to point out some of the lyrics, right? Uh, so the game has a pretty unremarkable verse. The one thing that I think is controversial is he says something, uh, something about, like, b what does he say? I don't know. I wasn't listening. At all. Oh, he says, I got shot up like Columbine. The Oof. crypts descended upon me. <laughs> too soon. Too soon. You can't do that. Oh my gosh, they don't have Yeezy's verse. They only have the game's verse. That's racist. Oh my gosh. So what's funny about Yeezy is he he rhymes together with together. <laughs> yep. I'm going to say his rhyming on this is a little There's lazy. a lot of bad rhyming. There's a lot of bad everything. Because he's like, yo, this will be the your best divorce ever. Which is referring to she's been divorced like four. Remember she was divorced from that basketball player Chris for like Humphreys. six days. Chris Humphreys. Yeah, for like six days. Yeah. 
Yeah. I remember that. She, she, who did she marry before? Ray J, maybe? I don't think they were married. I don't know. I feel like you have a phone. I'm not going to Google You can't Google I don't want Kim Kardashian on my phone. <laughs> uh, so she's been married several times. And he, and then he says, like, we could have the best divorce ever. I, We could go together. We could pick up your sister and we could go together. Together and together makes sense. It ends so the same. So much sense. One of my other favorite rhymes that he says is, uh, all respect to the nannies, but I watch four children for five hours a day. That's not a rhyme. No, but it's pretty funny, right? I, uh, yeah. He I has nannies and he's like, I respect them, but I watch them. I watch the kids for five hours a day. Or does he day. watch the nannies for five hours a day? He also says that, it, it, what's the point of being rich? He says, I move next to you because I can. Because what's the point of being rich if I can't? Yeah, like if you're rich, why can't you harass your ex? Like I that's guess. Your God given right. It sounds like a thing you should do. Yeah. This is the motorcycle. Remember I said the motorcycle where they bang? Yeah. I, I uh, Should I Google that? What he should I will done. Google that. I don't want to see that. You do. I, I really don't. He should buy every house around the block. Like the entire every block. single house. He should buy the entire block. Like, what is this? This close-up of that his face. That was disturbing. It's, it, this is pretty... If the song was better, I was even thinking that I could rap better. Because you have a slow beat, you need fast-paced rhymes. You need your rhymes to hit. Okay. You need them to be fly. Like, you gotta be fire. Gypsy Eminem over here. That's right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then he he grows a Pete Davidson plant with with roses. Yep. What with else roses, did he say? He, something else? He said something about oh he goes I'm a beat Pete Davidson's ass. And then the thing the sample in the background is like who? Yes. Because he's not that famous. It's, it's not subtle at all. I mean, how does this guy go from dating Ariana Grande to Kate Beckinsale? There was other ones in between, probably, but... Oh, I'm sure, but he's dating, like, A-listers. Like, the top of the top. Yeah. How does he do that? I mean, looks-wise, Kim Kardashian's not that great, but... Uh, Kate Beckinsale. No, Ariana that's... Grande's, like, all right. She looks like a 15-year-old Midget. boy. Uh-huh. With hair extensions? She d Yeah, the hair extensions are not great. No. And then Kate Beckinsale is the is a cr they're creme de la crazy. Creme. There's there's a clear path of crazy though. Yeah, because he knew that Pete Davidson knew that Ariana Grande liked to lick donuts publicly. Yeah. And the Kate Beckinsale is clearly batshit crazy. Because she would clearly have a three way with her daughter. Oh my god, most likely, and probably the ex husband Michael Sheen, four way. Oh my gosh, what, what was her other? Oh, her other ex husband filmed her in a nude sex scene in Underworld. Yeah. Banging some dude. Yeah, Scott Speedman. Yeah, pretty weird. Lynn Wiseman? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah. So then he, tr I guess he trims all of the the bushes away or something? I'm not sure. I guess that's how he gets his head. He's like, I'm just going to trim your head, bro. Because now he's he's dead. It's, yeah. It's and disturbing then he's, imagery. Yeah, it's pretty, it, of course, is Ye a genius? I mean, he's very poetic. I don't. I think this is not his best rapping. I do love at the end. He's like J.K. Pete's fine. It, well, he says everyone lived happily ever ever after, except Pete, except Skeet. You know who? But he says, just kidding. J.K. Like he's fine. It. Wait, J.K. J.K. JK he's, he's fine. fine. That was good. I like that. That made me laugh. Cause it's easy. That was better than the song. Like that little end line joke. Yeah, so that video is something. It is. Something to behold. He was definitely forcible with it. Oh, Did he not have Pete himself. Davidson consent at all. No missing consent. Yeah. Because if you don't like and subscribe to this video, Noob Noob will be forced to do this with Pete Davidson. I will make an artistically poignant video where instead of roses, I plant your corpse and rotting body with tulips because that's my favorite flower. And then because I will use Because you love Denmark. That. To, uh, in Amsterdam. Is that the tulip yes. capital of the world? Yeah, well, I will sell those, and I will sanction a trip to Denmark to become their president and lead a vicious invasion in Russia and take back our Netherlands. Will you be throwing clogs? I will. And windmills. Boosh! 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 And apples. Boosh! Boosh! That's clogs. 
Boosh's sure. clogs. Whatever clogs are. Anyway, be sure to like and subscribe because uh, you can also catch our free full-length audio podcast anywhere you can find podcasts. Stitcher, Spotify, Google Play. I don't Rumble. know. Places. Rumble. Don't forget Rumble. You can check it. Rumble us. Instagram. Instagram. Orc underscore you. All of those places because you know what? Pfft, we're on to the next one. Yeah.